So we're at our Tilbury site on the Port of Tilbury. We process incinerated bottom mesh, which comes in from our EFW client. We will then process the material, turn it into an aggregate, taking out the metals, etc. Um, and then the aggregates will be sold as a recyclable aggregate. Every night we do what's called a clean down. So every night that when the processing stops, um, we set aside time for the plant to be cleaned down and ready for the next morning. Um, with this particular piece of equipment, it means getting inside, opening it up, and cleaning it out, making sure all the areas are clear, everything's rotating and turning, ready for the next morning. Well, all the hazards were identified by our optives um, that actually work on the equipment themselves. Um, they then raised safety concerns and near misses, um, and obviously one of them was raised through a, via an accident, um, and that's where they then helped and aided in the devices that were implemented as well. So what we did, the first one was the opening of the crusher. Um, one of the bolts is at the very top and made it very hard to get to. We tried numerous um, podium steps, ladders, etc. Um, they never really worked. It meant the employee would have to find a key and unlock them to be able to use them. Um, so what we did, we installed a fixed set of steps, which can be removed should we never need to do any maintenance, but it allows the, the operative to get straight up undo the bolt, and therefore it's nice, simple and easy to use, therefore they're more likely to use it. Once they've done that and they open up the crusher, um, that then presented a further risk, which was a falling from height risk. Um, simply with the crusher being opened up, there's about a five foot drop to the vibrating feeder below. Um, originally, the employees would either use um, scaffold boards to put across, but they can move and slide, or they would have straddled across the opening. So we designed a metal plate that went across. It uses the fixings from the uh, crusher itself, and therefore it's nice, simple, and easy to use. Um, we then had an issue with the rotor, so there is a pin that's installed which is uh, supplied with the machine. We had a chain installed on that to make sure that it stayed insecure, but it was an item that could be quite easily forgotten. Um, and following an incident at one of our sites, um, it was sent across to all our sites for someone to find a solution. So a couple of sites come up with very similar designs, um, and this became the final one that went in at every single site. And again, it's nice and simple. They can lift it up, put it in. It uses the fixings of the machine to put it in place. It also means it can never be left in and closed in with the machine in operation because you can't use the fixings have obviously got to be removed so it made it nice simple and safe. Yeah it means pretty much we've eliminated which is obviously number one in the hierarchy to eliminate the risk as well. Um, we've managed to do that. Um, it means that the employees can work on this piece of equipment safely and secure and we know you know it's around all of our sites now. Once it was designed in one it went to every single site so every piece of equipment has the same installed on it to make sure everyone stays safe.